They laughed at us. They called us conspiracy theorists when we said that the United States government had removed Imran Khan, the Prime Minister of Pakistan, from office. But it is now as clear as a Hunter Biden bank statement that that is exactly what happened and that the proximate reason for it was Imran Khan's visit to Russia and his refusal to side with the war party of NATO in isolating and seeking a military political confrontation with Russia, which had never done Pakistan any harm. The U.S. ambassador in Islamabad was very clear about it. Remove your prime minister or the going is going to get very tough between us in the weeks and months ahead. They said that we were making it up, that Khan had been removed because of arcane constitutional issues inside Pakistan. But it is revealed in the leaked cables now accessible by anybody on the internet that the American ambassador met with the members of Khan's own party, members of parliament of Khan's own party, and persuaded them to lota, to turn their coat, to abandon their party, become independents, and then vote against Khan in the subsequent vote of confidence in the Pakistan National Assembly. 